my sciatica. Welcome. The nurse has given me my pills and I'm all set to go and I am so excited. It's Thimbleweed Park. My god, my nipples could cut spaghetti. All right, let's see. So we're going to go into the new game. Ron Gilbert has said he hates he hates tutorials. He really does because it it uh gets rid of the inquisitive nature of gamers. And he's absolutely right. I'm with him 110% on that one. Uh, we're not doing casual. We're doing hard mode. Um, and there's, uh, yep, there's nothing more exciting in life than playing adventure games. Uh, this is also Gary Winnick, who's not really um, on social media that I can see of, but Ron Gilbert really is. He's all over the place. So um, make sure you give him big kudos for this game. We'll, well, 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 let's not rush the judgment, even though I know Ron Gilbert's going to make a great game. Again, I looked at the controls and everything of that nature. I just wanted to see if he put it in, and yes, he did. A period will end the sentence, so you don't have to go through the whole spiel of a sentence. You can just hit the period button. So, here we go. 1987. What was I doing in 87? High school. Yeah, most, of people, most people are going, wow, wow. Oh, man. That's right. But you're all in here in the nursing home with me. Ah, oh, pixel art. Mmm, it looks so beautiful. It's taking me back here. And my first computer playing these. And then I built my first computer. So the first computer I had was pre-bought. And uh, the, the other one I built. I built one later. And that's where I did play a lot. Uh, these games again. Ooh, population 81. Ooh, down to one. Here we go. Very Twin Peaks like. If you didn't know what Twin Peaks was, then uh, look it up. sound they did the sound perfect in the background the only thing I don't like so far is that uh, I don't have to do full screen but the I couldn't maximize the window as much as I wanted to I fly halfway around the world and an odd note is waiting for me in my hotel room it says to come to the bridge down by the river and be in German like the place be a German, I never. Dolphina Schnitzel after the long walk out here. Oh, Dolphina Schnitzel, I don't want to be like you Americans and drink your Zimas. Oh, beautiful. So who is this guy? Is this guy our hero? Willy Willy. All right. Open gate. Now I wonder if it's like normal old Ron Gilbert games where I could L, 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 L. No. Talk to. Close. Use Willy. Well, C is use Willy. Alright, well, we'll just do it the old fashioned way here. Let's see what we got. Boris, I'm glad you decided this is the right solution to our problem. There are eyes everywhere, so follow these steps precisely. For your own protection, leave your ID in your hotel room. Go down to the river, down by the Trestle Trail Bridge. Turn off the light above the trestle trail sign so I know you have arrived. Meet me at the large entrance to the underground sewers. Make sure you are not followed. All right, Boris. Uh, this should be. It is my wallet, and it has two hundred fifty-two American dollars in it. Oh, American dollars! Oh, I'm so broke. But uh, Boris, I don't see why you're not getting mucho vibes, weirdo vibes from this scenario. It is the key card for my room. Okay. It is a pillow bear prototype. Turn the bear inside out and you get a pillow. Very top secret. Oh, let's kill I had better not turn it inside out now. Why not? All right, let's talk to Willie. Oh, good God. I really hope that it's not a lot of lines here. I am supposed to meet someone down here. Have you seen anyone? Do you have any whiskey? Are you sure you have not seen anyone? 
I'm glad Chuck is dead. Ruined my life. It, is it Le Chuck? Wake up, sir. Wake up, sir. Oh, well. I have to go. Sleep well. Walk there. No. Let's just look at Willie. Ah. I have to go. Sleep well. And I can run. Okay, here we go. Signal trail to Thimbleweed Park. 1.7 miles. Alright, so we have to. I guess the pull. sign does not move. It is attached firmly in place. Alright, so we're gonna use the light. I do not see a way to turn it off. Are you kidding me? Pick that? I don't want to pick that up. Right? Isn't that... Turn it off. I do not see a way to turn it off. Hmm. Okay, we're going to have to find something. I wonder if I can use this rock to put out the light. That's what we're going to do. Puzzle. I have completed step three of the note. Well, now step on three. Step four. Now on to step four. Large grower. All right. At the ground sewers. <coughs> Pixel hunting, as this is called. Nice little fireflies. Yeah, that one line of dialogue. I don't know. Um. I think David. What the heck was that? Was that a person? It did not look like a person. Ooh. Wait a minute. Boris is halfway across. The... He's German. So how did that lose one of the population? Oh well. I guess they count you as soon as you come in. They're so desperate. Ooh, very Twins Peaks. X-Files, too. What I was going to say about that first line of dialogue is that uh, uh, another David Fox is uh, part of this, and uh, I've seen his Twitter. Tell me again why you're here. I was assigned to the case by the so home he office does in Albuquerque. Believe in a certain ideology. I just hope those jokes there aren't no home all over this game. It's neat to know. Look, I like working a case alone. I especially don't need some junior agent messing up my investigation. Especially some junior agent that thinks I don't know there isn't a home office in Albuquerque. So stay out of my way. Take a lot of notes. Sit back and learn. And I'll wrap up this case and we can both get the hell out of here. Your reputation certainly precedes you, Agent Ray. I think it's I'll called that bitch. As a compliment, Agent Reyes. It's how it was intended. I'm sure it was. Let's photograph the victim and head into town to talk to the local sheriff. The body is starting to pixelate. Pixelate. <laughs> body starting to pixelate. This is going to be a long night. I like you, Agent Ray's. You're already pissing her off. <laughs> Smug. All right, let's see. That's the coroner's job. Oh, so we're not going to pick him up. Look at Appears to be a male, approximately 40 years old. Looks like he's been in the water for 24 hours. Wow. You can tell by the pixelation around the nose and neck. Let's see here. There's no wallet in his pockets. But I found a card. Possibly a key card from a hotel. Good going, Race. Appears to be a male, 40 years old, 24 hours, hotel key card, small hole in the back of the head. Ooh, jeez. Back of head. Doesn't look like a gunshot, so puncture from a sharp object. Yeah, some kind of ghost. This suit looks tailored, possible European in design. Ray is going to get on my nerves. Hopefully she stays and uh, lets me do what I need to do. Okay, so he's he's trying to get stuff done. Riding payload work from Albuquerque by bus. So she's saying there is no office in Albuquerque, so this guy maybe have some ulterior motives here. 
cover. This is the perfect cover. Yep. Still walking along the highway, a long way from town. And Agent Ray is here, which is uh, no one should have been assigned to this case. I may have heard of her from rumors around the office. Might pose some problems for me. Remember to call mom tonight. Oh, call mom tonight. But uh, so he wait. He is. Let me see if I can use. Hmm. There's no film in the camera. Hmm. Okay. So we do here. Oop. Options. We got the options. Sorry about that. <laughs> So she's got her notebook. Got into town late this afternoon. What a dump. I try to avoid contact with the locals. Oh, well, what a... Boy, she's, she's smug, no-nonsense kind of agent. I see the body and figure out if it will suit my needs. If it will suit my needs? Hope I have to walk that again. Arrive at the body. She just do fine as my cover. So she has ulterior motives as well. Rustling in the bushes. Someone's coming. Great. Another... Some other agents just showed up. I wasn't aware. Bureau had been alerted. I need to ditch him. Okay. So this might not be an agent case. Detective Angela Ray, senior agent. It's a cell phone. Wow. Don't be smug and condescending. It's a cell phone. To me. The cell phone has no reception. It's a sample package of Polaroid film. Oh, she's getting it on my nerves. contains one photo. You're getting on my nerves. Thanks. Ray, you're gonna be to my man. Focused and solve this murder, so I can do what I need to do. All right, so he swapped something else. All right, now we can use it. Smile. He's got a sense of humor too. Now we can head into town and find the local sheriff. Dead ringer for the body. Oh. <laughs> he finally, he's like, oh, I made a joke, but, uh, oh. So, let's. That's disgusting. There appears to be a small hole in the back of the head. Origins unknown. The hole in the victim's head doesn't look like a gunshot. More like a puncture from a sharp object. Which is odd, because the opening title sequence clearly showed a gunshot with accompanying sound effect. Oh, so we, we're doing some fourth wall, which is something Ron likes to do. I like it. So let's go over here. Maybe she'll get knocked out before we have to deal with it. Whoop! It's covered by the underbrush. But it's an old abandoned chainsaw. Fool me once, shame on me. <laughs> Fool me twice. Yeah, well, we'll pick it up, but the chainsaw disappointment, yes, the chainsaw with no gas. So we can't use it. And we'll probably never be able to use it. Just like in Maniac Mansion. Ah, uh, look at that, the old tree. We need it for the old no tree. trees blocking the great entrance. Whoa. Sounds like someone in the sewer is playing the violin. That old tree is blocking the great entrance. Let me look at the tree. Oh, there we go. Hmm. There are signs of a struggle here. This is clearly a drag mark. The victim was obviously knocked out here, then dragged over to the stream. I don't see any blood, so I think he was actually killed in the water. All right, so we've got a drag mark. Anything else? The trail ends here at this huge rock wall. What is this? It's my speck of dust. All right. So you got your own speck of dust. Good going, Agent Ray. You're going to crack this case in no time. No more pixel hunting. No more, no more. Poor Boris. He was such a nice German young man. The bulbs broken. Can find anything Trestle out? Trail to Thimbleweed Park, 1.7 miles. Oop, I thought I saw something. No, it's just the gate. So we can hold that down. Now let's get Ray it's up here. Don't let her out of your sight, Race. Look at the tuna can. It's an empty can of 
Crockford's tuna heads with good parts. Hmm. All right. Tuna can. There used to be like the the tuna heads, right? Let's look at this. Behind jaggy lines from Mucus Flem Games. Mucus Flem. I get it. Who'd ever let a game be named? Oh that? my God. So uh, is that Ron uh, saying that uh, he was not too happy? Behind with jaggy lines from Mucus Flem Games. I don't get it. Who'd ever let a game be named that? Oh, by the way, I did the font, like the C64 font, font, and uh, I just thought it would get me in the mood a little bit better. So we could double click to run. Whoa! What is that? Did they stop? Oh, wait. It's a circus flyer with a crazy looking clown on it. Pretty good makeup, though. Ugh, clowns. I don't like clowns. Signals are very strong tonight. Oh my god. Is this. This is very Twin Peaks like. You know, weirdos in the town? I'm asking the obvious. Why are you dressed like a giant pigeon? We're the Pigeon Brothers Plumbing. I'm Beth. That's my sister Emily. Hi there! But remember. Signals are very strong tonight. Alright, why brothers if you're sisters? Oh god, I hope this isn't another kind of like a uh, social... Why brothers if you're sisters? Dad was expecting to have sons. I mean, it was too cheap to have the van repainted. So we're just rolling with it until he's dead. Oh, Sam. Shut up, Emily. But that is funny. Very That's very tonight. good. That's, I like that one. Alright, so what signals? What signals. The signals. Signals are very strong tonight. Yes, you already said that. But what signals? <laughs> I'm just screwing with you. Dark night. Deserted road. Me in a giant pigeon costume? It was too good to pass up. <laughs> the signals are strong tonight. So we're very gonna get the... Strong. So these guys, uh, hopefully they'll be around. We'll have to interact with them more. <laughs> Another fourth wall joke, okay. This is really odd. Should I save my game? I wouldn't worry about it. The game was expertly designed to have no dead ends or death. Yet still be scary and have a sense of tension. You can feel safe exploring whatever you want. But I'd watch out for the signals. They can be very strong and disrupt the power grid. All right, that one just went in my left ear and my headphones. And let's just roll with this joke. I think this is a Sierra Online joke, and I haven't heard good Sierra Online jokes in a while, because those games were frustrating. Space Quest, King's Quest, uh, Police Quest. Did I say that one? Police Quest, Space Quest, King's Quest. But playing classic adventure games has taught me to save often. That was true, up until Monkey Island. At least with LucasArts style adventures. Then the designers realized that death and dead ends weren't making the game more enjoyable. They were they not. They were actually making it less fun. No, we're just gonna we're just gonna preach. It okay. Seems like a sensible approach to adventure game design. It is. It just takes a little longer and requires more thought and planning. But it really pays off in the end. It does. It really does. You almost ran over a federal agent. That's a felony. Sorry about that. Like I said, the signals are very strong tonight. Do you know anything about the body by the bridge? Why is it whenever a dead body is found, suspicion always falls to the person dressed as a giant bird? <laughs> hey, if the beak fits. We don't know anything about a dead body, but the signals are strong tonight. Oh my god, you and the yes. signals. So that's probably going to play a part. It's Chekhov's gun, right? It's gonna play a part tonight. But the best thing about these games, oh, and this is so nice. I am so excited just seeing this. It is so much more beautiful than the old type, but it's got the same feel. It is, oh, it's so groovy. I think I've had enough of you. I need to find the sheriff and solve a murder. Nice talking to you too. Squeak. One. <laughs> Beep. It's a plumbing van, driven by big pigeons. Ooh, 
Yes, it is. No need. The perps are outside. Oh, so we can't. Wow. All right, let's go here. Pixel hunt. Wait, what's that? Another speck of dust. What are these things? From a six pack, you're supposed to cut them up before tossing them. Saves wildlife. Yes. Can I pull it and pull them apart? I can't apart? pull that. Can I open up? That would be the correct thing to do. I'll just throw them away instead. She, she really is. Oh, oh, there they go. Ooh, now we got a cemetery. All right, Ray's. It's not running. It's more like a, that little power walking type of thing. But okay. Ooh. Let's get Ray's in there. Or Ray in there. We got Ray and Ray's. Oh, this is disappointing. Oh, this is very disappointing. Usually in these games you can... Uh, you could read the graves or something of that nature. They could, you know, could be supporters of the game. Ah, uh, can't read any of them. Oh, be on the lookout for those specks of dust, because apparently they're all over the place. Maybe this is long. Here we go. Get on up there, Agent Reyes. God, there's more? Okay. But still, the pixel hunting, I can Oh, where'd she go? Okay. But still, the pixel hunting, I'm not getting anything. That speck of dust, I don't see anything with the speck of dust. Alright. Chuck. The Chuck? It's Chuck's final resting place, apparently. The heavy wrought iron gate to the tomb is closed, but I see a switch inside. Hmm. It's a cell phone. Yes, yeah, stop. The cell phone has no reception. So she has no reception outside of here. Well, back in the old days, it was very hard to get reception, except in major cities. All right, so let's see. Look at the flowers. Flowers left over from a funeral. All right, so she's got a flower. A flower from the cemetery. Go over here. Maybe Rays will have a better. Well, maybe Rays will have better dialogue, a better information about Chuck here. I shouldn't say anything out loud, but seeing Chuck's tomb in person makes me a little happy inside. Ooh, okay. So Reyes has something against Chuck. All right, so his ulterior motive is something with Chuck, and so that's probably why he's here. Can he pick up flowers? Flowers always die. I'd rather leave these to rest in peace. No, oh, very nice. All right. Well, back around we go. All right, so we're back here. I skipped all that walking apart. I pixel hunted up the wazoo. Um, Let's see, take a look at this bottle. It's an empty soda bottle. I didn't see anything Plasma there. Deposit in Michigan, Hawaii, California, Arkansas, Idaho, Wisconsin, Nevada, Georgia, Virginia. Oh my gosh, she's gonna go through everything. Vermont, Maryland. You gotta say Kansas, and Michigan North at the Carolina, end. Texas, Montana, Tennessee, South Dakota, District of Columbia, Florida, South Carolina, Washington, Arizona, Montana, Oh my god. Jersey, she's going all through it. Delaware, Utah, and Michigan. Maine, Ohio, Mississippi, Illinois. North Dakota, Nebraska, Arkansas, Colorado, 
Louisiana, New York, New Mexico, Missouri, West Virginia, <laughs> there it is. Rhode Island, New Hampshire, Iowa, Wyoming, Pennsylvania, Oklahoma, Oregon, Indiana, Alabama, and Michigan. Well, I'll tell you what, at, at least you know, uh, you learned something here. And you learn that uh, the designations for the states. Oh my goodness, what is this? Someone is watching us. Yes, very Twin Peaks vibe here. Or the smoking man. Wait for me. Bullet hole, but it doesn't seem to be a bullet. Thimbleweed Park. Nice name for a town. I have a feeling Ray won't feel that way. More like Thimble Stupid. <laughs> there we go. All right, so uh, got Main Street here. It says Main Street. Detective Antonio Reyes, junior agent. It's definitely my badge. It's definitely my badge? And he's looking away. He's looking that way. Are you lying, Ray? Ray's? Okay. So, well, let's just see if we can talk to somebody here. Willie's Watch and Violin Repair Shop. Oh, no. Thimbleweed County's most exclusive watch and violin repair. We repair watches and violins for the rich or famous. How about the rich and famous? But Willie was down there when Boris died. There was a violin playing in the sewer. It doesn't look good for Willie. Let's see if we can open up the door. I can't open that. No. Ray? I can't open that. How about this? Closed. Looks like they cleared out in a hurry. Right, the boom. Bust. Oh! Howdy! I'm the Thimbleweed Park Sheriff. I don't remember calling the Federinos. Eh, that's what you are, Feds. Hard to miss the government issue suits. <laughs> uh, what? Yeah, how long were you going to let the body rot in the how river? How long were you going to let that body rot in the river? Ah, the river is so chock full of chemicals from the old pillow factory. It's better off there than in a tub of formaldehyde. I guess you're here about our little murder Reno out by the bridge. Oh, so little about murder, sir. <sighs> Ignore him. He's new. Oh, shut up, Ray. No sense in wasting everyone's time, Reno. This cutscene is starting to get long, and it's only going to get longer. <laughs> Let's find the corner and uh, get you on your way. Wrestling starts at 8. Wrestling! Uh, he's talking about on TV. No, he's talking about Hulk Hogan. The coroner is waiting for you in his office. Come see me when you're done. I apologize, Areno, for all the lights being off. We don't stay open as long as you city slick Arenos do at night. Even for a murder? Especially for murder. That makes no sense. It doesn't, Brass. Are we authorized to shoot people Arenos? Oh my goodness. Can we talk to each other? No, we can't. But we'll see the coroner next episode. Oh my god, he's going to watch wrestling with the Hulkster. Because it was 87. Hulk Hogan. And, oh yeah, the macho man. Yeah, you're a bunch of prima donnas, Marinos. Okay. And I'm going to go, the medicine's kicking in and I... Uh... Get up my interlawns!